welcome. Thank you for being here. This is the energy vibration reading for the Aries, sun, moon, and rising. Um, I want to say thank you for the likes and the share. Thank you for the support. Please thumbs up and welcome to all newcomers. This is the energy vibration reading for all the Aries people out there. Um, this is the last week of August 2016. It is the week number 34 and the weeks begins fun of the 22nd of August until the 28th of August 2016. The week is the week from rebuilding and this is so good. This is wonderful for you Aries people. And why is this so good for you Aries people? It's because it's a fire energy. And whenever this fire energy comes up for you guys, it is always releasing. And um, it is a time when you need to start rebuilding because that's the energy. Um, the element is fire and on Monday, it's going to be the element of fire. So whatsoever you're doing, make sure you plan it for Monday. The keyword is going to be release, release the old so that new can come in. The color is going to be red and the vibration of the week is your willpower and passion. You need to bring back the passion in your life. Not only passion in your love life, but passion in yourself as a person. The angel you can call upon is Archangel Shamuel. The number seven is the number of this week. And this is saying wisdom. This is really um, a time where you're going to um, seek inner wisdom. Okay. As we look at the week on Monday, Monday is a very good week for you guys. The earth energies is here in, in this week and the energy vibration of the star is here. And this is star is saying to you is that whatever you are planning or whatever plans or whatever situation that you want, it's going to be a success. It's going to be a success and, um, good luck is here with you. Okay. As we look at Tuesday, you are vibrating with the energies of trust. That is an air energy. And whenever the energies of trust comes in, it is vibrating in the zodiac vibration of the herd. So this is good. This is like, you know, trust yourself, trust yourself. Um, something is going to be known to you because there's a secret. There is, there is a secret about something here, but it's going to come to light to you. There is a secret. It has something to do with papers and whatever. It's going to come to light to you. You have nothing to worry about. On Wednesday, um, there's energy of teaching and the cross is here. So whatever secrets that people were having, um, about you, um, the energy is going to break it on Wednesday. So if people were there, um, a group of people were there having a secret, uh, um, against you or holding something or uh, yeah, it is a secret they have against you. The energy comes in to break it on Wednesday. On Thursday, the energy of the lovers is here and it is also govern and comfort in with the energies of, uh, um, yeah, oh, the universe and your guides and angels are going to send you a little surprise, okay? Because there was a lot of people talking about you and it come to an end of Wednesday and on Thursday, universe and your guides are going to bless you with something. So look out. Um, it doesn't have to be tangible things. It can be information. It can be people telling you about whatever was going on. As we look at um, Friday, it's movement. And yes, something is going to come to an end on Friday. It is okay. And all of this situation that was going on, people talking about your back, back and, and keeping secrets, that's all going to end on Friday, okay? On Saturday, there's another ending. On Saturday, you have the energy of control and there is going to be another ending. It is okay. You don't have to always have control over everything. An ending come to the situation that has been going on. On Sunday is the energy of seek. And this, uh, on a Sunday, be careful that you don't get in any quarrels with a family member or with people around you, people who you work with, or if you go to supermarket or something, because the energy of conflict is here on Sunday. I want to say to you guys, the overall energy is that no matter what is going on, um, 
financially you are good and stable and if not it's going to start to vibrate in that energy vibration please stay tuned for the general readings well um this is the week um this is general readings for the week the last week of august 2016 and we have the energy of the number 34 it's the 34 week of uh, the year 2016 and it says a leg up and whenever this energy of a leg up comes in that means someone and the universe and your spirit guides and your angels and guides are going to send you help unexpected help is going to come in to help you with whatever situation issues that you're going through in your life at this moment whenever this energy comes up it is wonderful because the universe and your guides and angels show you that you're not alone and they hear your prayers and they hear your asking and they hear your wishes and dream and the answers is coming by people unexpected events and effect is going to come in your life to help you to give you that foot up to where you would want to be in your life that help as if you know like when you're looking for work and somebody just unexpected say oh you know i just saw that they're looking for someone at this place that is like a leg up because um, the universe is going to send someone to you to help you along your way. And that person will say, oh, I saw this ad or some, I know a friend of mine who is looking for a friend of mine. That's like a leg up. So look out, open up yourself for it. Okay. The next uh, energy we have is from the wisdom, the hidden room of the wisdom. And it says the winged um, wise one, angelical help miraculous and um help is coming true aid is coming true this is so fantastic because just as i said a leg up this is the same energy that 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 it means it means that the angelical ones are there helping you behind the scenes without you seeing them they are there and you know the, the angels and guides they listen to your prayers and they answer them and sometimes they're not answered in the way that you had expected to be answered but the universe and your guides and angel only give you the things that you need and that is going to help you on your journey and this just like the same one when it says a leg up, the wing one or hair, and they're going to aid you in a miraculous situation. You know, like um, you got a bill and you have no idea how it's going to pay it, and you said, oh my God, help me, I don't know. And um, somebody just come up or some something that you weren't expecting just come in and then it, that's like miraculous help so whenever we ask uh, and we don't even say just ask for a miracle for your situation whatever is going on in your life for help as we move on to the next energy from the map it says add the to, from the energies it says adore to personal healing and this is so wonderful because um whenever we understand and we connect with our guides and our angels it's like we're healing ourselves, but we're healing everything around us. And what is happening is that by doing that and understanding that we are just spiritual beings, a door, the door to your personal healing and happiness will happen. Because once we realize that we are not alone here and they are more help to us and who we are. We are not just a person, but we are a spiritual beings. We are the gods and goddesses. Then we we kind of connect and realize that we are all connected. And then um, things just start to resolve themselves. And then you will have personal healing. The next one I have is the spark and I just so love this. This is just a wonderful week with these wonderful energies because the spark is here because after you accept yourself and you, you realize that the things around you and the things that happen to you um, happen for a reason because there are lessons that you need to learn. You have opened the door to your personal healing and then you will see the spark of magic, the spark of who you are, your true 
spiritual um, um, form will come out. You as love, you as pure light will come out and that will be the spark of your soul and the beam who you truly are. This is just wonderful for um, the last week and I want to say thank you for being here and I will speak to you in the month of September. Namaste.